Hi, I'm Yaya and for the last nine years, uh, people have been calling me Mr. Yaya or just Cher because um, I am a teacher and to my right, this was my ex-student from many, many years ago. So hi guys, I'm Shanice and he's my teacher from Primary 6, Mr. Yaya, but I call him Cher all the time. You call every teacher Cher? No, only you. Only me, yeah. Oh. <laughs> yeah, and I don't keep contact with like my other teachers except for him. Because I have fun, right? Questionable. <laughs> Questionable. <laughs> I mean, the last time I saw you, you had specs on and then you had black hair. So, what's with the lifestyle change? Primary 6, my mom say cannot I wear contact lens. Primary 6 cannot. Yeah. <laughs> I also will say cannot. So, the reason I, I could still contact her after all these years is because um, I follow her on Instagram. Like, every photo of her Instagram grid is a different hair colour. So there's like blonde Chinese, then green Chinese, then blue Chinese. Are you okay or not? Are you okay or not? No. Like every time you change it, is it because something is bothering you? No, life? no. You know who is Donghan? Donghan? Am I supposed to know who is Donghan? It's okay if you don't know, but because I saw him change hair color. You lost me at Donghan. <laughs> you bullied me before. I bullied you yeah, before? You first really? Day, no, okay, okay. Not, not to that extent, but on okay. the first day of school. And then after you were asking me which city I'm from, then I'm saying Kuchang. Then okay. at the end of the class, you just hand me like the, the one to wipe the board. Then you ask me to wipe the board on the first day of lesson. Then you say, okay, you be music monitor. <laughs> so that after happened. all these years, you've kept that inside you. No, I You got... waited for this moment to let it out on I camera and say, you bully me. <laughs> Actually, I, I specialize in math and science. But it just so happens that year that they asked me to teach music. I was quite nervous lah, because I'm not really trained to teach music. But I'm really thankful for like people like Shanice. Um, I think she really stepped up on that day and I think now I can I tell you up. Yeah, actually you are actually talkative <laughs> la. On camera I say you step up la, but actually you are talkative And therefore you were chosen oh. Not bully lah, this one is giving you leadership oh. opportunities eh. I'm grooming the next generation of Singaporeans I was, I was P6 Yeah, then I remember you, you performed solo right, Kutsen in school you know, do you know that your photo of your solo performance is still on the board? I think it was for the Moon Festival. No, I think because the teacher lazy to change. Oh. They so they take your picture and put that. <laughs> so are you still doing music now? Um, K-pop not, not counted. <laughs> uh, <laughs> listening to Dong Han. I'm doing mass comm and journalism. Ah, yeah. so you're doing media lah. Actually, I watched one of your videos before. On YouTube? The one you were crying ah. Oh no, that one, that, one, that, one was my, that one was my friend's um, FYP. Okay, but I think you have a talent <laughs> in crying. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> okay, like you mentioned, I taught your sister, right? You didn't teach her. I don't think I taught her, you, I taught her, you taught her PE. Then she said, there's this girl in her class called Janice. Okay. And then you were looking at Sh uh, my sister, and then you were like, Shanice, can you do it like Shanice? Like you said, you called her Shanice instead of Shanice. I called your sister Shanice. Yeah. Uh, you feel honoured or something? Or? <laughs> Maybe. What's the point of your story? Are you like... <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, the, the thing I remember most about you and your, your sister is that you are very, very different people. Oh yeah. You are this and <laughs> your sister is just like um, goody two shoes. Ah. If she was here during the interview, it would just be me talking. It would just be a yes or no interrogation. Probably won't even look at you. Yeah, she won't even look at me. <laughs> she won't even talk to me. Yeah, yeah. I've never seen both of you talk about boys. Oh. Not that I want to be capable or what lah. I mean, such a boomer thing right, to ask about. Yeah. Getting married soon or what? Getting married. I don't want to get married. You don't want to get married? Yeah. Okay. I respect that choice. And I don't have kids. It's quite difficult to find someone that wants to, you know, not get married and have kids and everything. So, I think it's better to just not start anything. Like, on my side. Me ah. I am not married. Past few years, I've, I've devoted my life, invested my life so much into my work that um, that part of my life I've not really focused on. Okay, lah, you got any friends or what? Friends? To intro you? Ah. Jo, a bit. Okay, okay, for info, all my friends are like that. And make new friends, ah. I'll make new friends. <laughs> <laughs> Do you ever thought that you'll become a teacher? No, I, I know some people have dreams of I want to be a teacher when I grow up. That was the furthest from my mind. I didn't even like studying. I only decided I wanted to be a teacher during NS. During ORD, I was thinking, what am I going to do with my life? And then I talked to some people and some people recommended I try teaching. So I did try this, this thing called contract teaching where you try first. And if you don't like it, you can quit anytime. Like there's no bond or anything. So I tried that and then yeah, I enjoyed dealing with the, the young people, developing them the interaction with the children and all that. La. Even after starting teaching, I didn't know how long I would stay. Look at where, where I am now. Okay, so what do you want to be when you grow up? No, that's the thing, because like... I'm Teacher? No, 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 okay. no. I'm 21 and I still don't know what I want to do. Hey, that's fine, that's fine. Even if you're like 30 and you tell me you don't know what you want, that, 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 that's okay because... <laughs> I like, hope I my dad smack no, me. No, I mean, no one has to conform to any template in life. To me, as long as you're happy, la, right? 
I think you want to say to me, this is your chance. Oh, so I just want to say that like, I've been really thankful for you. Because I feel like music has really brought us together. Because I'm not really close to all my teachers. But then I think because of music, like it really just brought us together. Okay, I want to show you something. Shana can help me grab that uh, notebook. Thank you. Okay, so I have this um, Teacher's Day letter that you wrote me. From like, I don't know which year. <laughs> so, <laughs> okay, so this one, I don't know whether the camera can see this. It says to Mr. Yaya, also known as Fallen Superhero. 90% of the Teacher's Day letters I get is addressed to Fallen Superhero. Fallen Superhero. Yeah, because that's my <laughs> online presence name. Let's look at your number one horrible handwriting. Oh, my handwriting is nice. Sorry, uh, as a teacher, I cannot accept this. Uh. Okay, I'll let you read first. Uh. <laughs> I'll let you read first. Yo, Mr. Yaya. <laughs> <laughs> she started out the letter with Yo, Mr. Yaya. Okay. Hello, hey, hey. <laughs> Happy Teacher's Day. Thank you for all your guidance and encouragement all this well. All this while. Thank you for always supporting me, for example, when it comes to Kuchang. To be very honest, you're my favorite teacher and I really miss your teaching. Fufu. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Uh, please come to XMS. Okay. I'm a secondary school. Really grateful to have you as my teacher too, and please continue making awesome remixes. But we'll always support you, Hashim. <laughs> From Shanice. <Okay. laughs> Popular 150 people. 150 people. Okay, can. Thank you. <laughs> Well, how do you even find this from like 9 years, 10 years ago? Yeah, I keep them in like folders and envelopes so whenever um, I feel nostalgic or I want oh, to cry. encourage myself <laughs> yeah, to remind myself why am I doing this as a teacher. Yeah, so I just randomly read. Like, so that day I was just cleaning my room and then I found this and I'm like, eh, Shernice, <laughs> Shernice, oh my god. Thank you for writing me this. To you maybe it's, it's small, it's just a small gesture but when times are hard, teachers do appreciate things like this. Yeah, and teachers they Teachers Day presents, right? Don't even buy expensive stuff like mugs la, or stuff like that. We have hundreds of those. Big pens. Ah, ah yeah. <laughs> Thank you for watching. Uh, it was really fun uh, catching up with Shanice. Uh, do comment below if you have anything to say to your teachers. Or teachers, if you have something to say to your students, also comment below. Alright, uh, click here to subscribe. And click here to watch our latest video. Alright, thank you. Bye. Are you crying? No, I'm not. I'm not crying. Why not?